I guess we'll see if he answers. Yep, hello? Vlad, what's going on, man? It's Nick from Taxi Garage. Hey, how you doing? Good, good, good. Just wanted to confirm that you had, uh, you know, selected the rip and ship package uh, for your stage yes, three. Yep. <laughs> you go ahead and rip and ship it, man. All right, dog. It's on the route. All right, stay safe. Thanks. Thanks, man. Bye-bye. Bye. All right, so uh, Vlad actually just selected uh, the rip and ship package for the build breakdown video that we're going to shoot. Uh, so basically, you know, Charlie did the last one, I think Ryan, something like that. But I just got back from the Freedom Factory, so I'm pretty fired up. And um, so I really haven't rode a cart since I drove my drift car, so I'm ready to uh, rip his and ship it. So um, stay tuned. So this is the one that's for the rip and ship package. Yeah, this that one is I... it. That's Midnight Initiative. Your chariot awaits. Thank you, sir. Stage trees. I like these things. They're so like linear in power. So, uh, all right, we're we gonna shoot it right here. Or we're, you want to shoot some more? You guys can see it's another build breakdown. What's up, brother? This is where I come to my little videos. Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to the Taxi Garage channel. First things first, if you guys want to like, smack that subscribe button below. Really appreciate it. Sorry I'm a little late, but never late to my own build breakdown. Because I had to run back to the shop to grab the almighty checkered flag. Looks like I should have pulled up a little bit closer so I can grant this, huh? So for any of you that are new to the channel, basically here at Taxi Garage, we make modified crazy carts. So today, as we normally do, after we finish an awesome build at the shop, we go over a full build breakdown on the latest creation that we just finished up. So let me grab the camera here. Well, we waited for a perfectly sunny day. So what I have here, shout out to Prismatic Powders. You guys are awesome. Hooking us up with this time. Hopefully the GoPro can see it, but this is a fractured cherry. So basically it's a black base and then it's got the red illusion on top. This is all very fractured, veiny like, super, super awesome. Um, I'll put a link in the description below to the full-blown photo shoot so you guys can see. But, yeah, I wanted to uh, wait for a sunny day so we can really show off the finish of this cart. This one is for a good buddy of ours. His name is Vlad. I'll put his Instagram here in the bottom as well. Look at her. Look at her just shining. So, Texture Garage Stage 3 Crazy Crazy Cart. Cosmetically, got the fractured red. And then also if you guys look here, it's an awesome, it's like a flat wrinkled black. So we went with the stanchion and flat wrinkled black. Complement that, we got the full drift bar as well. The rest of the cart, all fractured cherry. And that we have down here, it's like a, a Smurf cloud blue for the wheel. He wanted his own personal touch. Kind of dig it. Definitely stands out from the rest of the cart, but hey, we make every cart unique to the customer's build. 
So now what the Taxi Garage Stage 3 Crazy Crazy Car consists of, first things first, you're looking at our TG neck. So while we build these necks here, which are made in-house by Ryan, killer, killer job. Super, this looks like art when it's all powder coated and whatnot. So we've got our 500 watt TG motor. We've got the factory 55 tooth lower sprocket still. And then we've got the Taxi Garage solid tire. We've got TG grip strips installed on the wheel underneath here. All that power channeled through. Taxi Garage speed controller. Got our 3D printed end plates really dialed in here. Behind that, we have this one. This is a 36 volt, 12 amp hour lithium Taxi Garage battery. So this one, this one definitely gets it. Might as well do a startup. On. Lift the nose of the cart up here. You guys are ready. Three, two, one. All right, so this cart, definitely, definitely a ripper. Stage three, very popular build, especially for someone that's, you know, definitely getting into the crazy cart. They've kind of grown out of their stage one, not ready for full 48 volt, full send, but this cart, this used to be our daily drivers. We would ride this setup all the time, definitely reliable. Let me just turn this off here for a second. Pull up the checkered flag. If it wants to come out, this checkered flag has been in every cart. Still with me. We'll just put this inside, old drifty. All right, so now looking at back here, what you guys see sticking out. So once you start upgrading the cart, definitely holding the drift and stock casters is nearly impossible. So we threw on a set of our TG Wide Boy casters. Look, the cart's already rolling away. Already wants to go get some. So Wide Boy casters consisting of our good friends over at Loaded Boards. They got us these orangutan durian offset wheels. So we run these on the back here. Also our back here. This is where we run our RGB LED light kit. Super clean setup. Drill a hole in the back of the seat. Nice clean grommet, riveted in. And then all underneath is all the LED strips. Wow, this one is just... I had to bring out old Drifty today because red and red just wants to send. So I'll give you guys a clip. A little bit more clips of the walk around of this cart out in the sun. Once again, if you have any questions, comments, shoot us an email. We've been cranking these carts out left, right, up, down every day here. Um, super stoked. Couldn't do it without you guys. So most importantly, we appreciate you, all your support for all of you who found us by Googling crazy carts or crazy cart mods, upgrades. Hopefully we're out there so we can help get your cart back up and running or better yet, if you want a full blown custom crazy cart, we're definitely here for you guys. So now you guys are probably thinking, how am I gonna get this cart back to the shop? Well, that's why I have to say that I ride a standard size crazy cart is because old daily here, this is actually my daily drifter. So as you guys know, I do have another car that I feature here on the channel, but the beauty of this is I can fit this in the back of the hatch of my 350Z. If I had an XL, it'd be a different story. I have to get Nick's truck or Ryan's truck a big ordeal so that's what the convenience of having a standard size cart with all the upgrades this thing will run circles around a stock xl even an xl on our 48 volt that'd be a good battle i'd actually like to see that however this is my go-to so you guys know i have the green cart they've seen in all the previous videos the og green goblin that's my ride but here is basically the same chassis that i'm going to put in the z so I can get back to the shop. So, I'm not just gonna talk about it, let's just do it. <laughs> Pop the hatch. For all you Z33 owners out there, I'd get the new uh, struts for the, for the hatch. Super convenient now, instead of using a broomstick to hold it up. So what we do is, 
Bring your crazy cart around back. Pop it in the back here. And, believe it or not, all right, no lie in the back of the hatch. Let's show you guys. Dun da da da. Boom. Crazy cart, standard black frame, but this one's custom powdered, in the back of a 350Z. So you guys know this very nuisance like brace back here. Shout out to Njuku. Love you boys. So what I do is basically slide the, the seat, nothing gotta come off, steering wheel's still on. Slide it up under there, casters on the back there. Well, I did take out my spare tire, so that definitely gives me a few more, you know, inches down here so the cart can sit in the spear, uh, spare wheel well hole. But you guys check it out. All right, well, let's bring this back so Vlad can get his tracking number and close up the hatch in the Z with a crazy cart and get out of here. Thank you guys for watching. Vlad, this one's for you. I'm gonna go bring it back to the shop now, get it all nicely packaged, and send you tracking here by the end of the day. Send us a photo, some videos of you once you get it. But in the meantime, I gotta get back to the shop here because it's time for us to send it. We're going drifting. 350Z, crazy carts, probably both. Thanks for watching, stay tuned, appreciate you guys. Look forward to the next one. Peace out. As you guys can see, cart made it back safely. Now time to park old girl, bring this one inside because I'm here to send it. Open up. That is another Taxi Garage build breakdown uh, rip and ship edition. So uh, this is going to Vlad. I'm not even sure what location in the United States he's in, um, but I know that he's going to enjoy this thing because it is solidified ripper.